Researchers have found a solution for retrofitting old non-earthquake resistant buildings with a technology that can prevent major damage to such buildings from earthquake without compromising on their strength. The technology called semi-confined unreinforced brick masonry SCURBM can resolve the problem of spread of settlements in earthquake prone areas with constructions that have been built without flowing earthquake preventive measures. The historically must buildings technically called on reinforced masonry URM were built using modern building code. Thus they are much more likely to experience damage or collapse during an earthquake. URBM buildings have traditionally been widely adopted worldwide due to inexpensive and locally available construction materials. Just like in most developing countries located in earthquake prone regions, on reinforced brick masonry, URBM has been a common practice in urban, semi-urban and rural areas in India. Considering that major part of India are under the seismic zone 3 or 4 above and most of the URBM buildings are old and structurally deficient in strength. URBM buildings located in earthquake prone areas is extremely important and they should be protected. Researchers from Indian Institute of Technology Kanpur have explored the extent to which retrofitting of old buildings with SCURBM technology can be solved and they found that SCURBM can significantly enhance the energy dissipation capacity and ductility of the retrofitted buildings without compromising its strength, hence such buildings would have resulting superior performance in comparison to URBM buildings in during the earthquakes. The idea of the technology emerged from the confined masonry and earthquake resistant construction system where the masonry walls are built first and the concrete columns and beams are poured in afterward to enclose the walls. The URBM technology has a similar concept but does not seem to be implemented at a construction stage. It involves embedding of reinforced concrete RC bands through the partial thickness of the wall and can be implemented or retrofitted in old building. The researcher Lakshmi Lata, Samit Rai Chaudhary, Suparna Mukhopadhyay and Kumar Rajpai Baspai conducted this experiment on two identical full-scale single-story brick masonry building, a completely unreinforced URBM and the other retrofitted with semi-confining horizontal and vertical reinforced concrete elements. The two buildings were subjected to a test called reverse slow cyclic quasi-static loading protocol to quantify the impressive seismic performance of the SCURBM buildings compared to the URBM building. A pseudo dynamic testing facility PDTF for affordable experimental evaluation of the earthquake resistance of full prototype structured system developed with the guidance of Professor Durgesh Sirai under the Fund for the Improvement of Science and Technology Infrastructure Program of the Department of Science and Technology, Government of India was used for the test. They proved that the technology provides better integral action of the confining element and load-bearing walls to achieve the enhanced seismic performance. The results were published in the AAC Journal of Structural Engineering. This technology for the strengthening existing URBM buildings is not only architecturally aesthetics but can also be implemented easily by manpower available locally.